What's up, YouTube? I'm going to do a quick update on my Bulbophyllum bulbin. This plant is a small growing epiphyte that you find in uh, Malaysia to Thailand at elevations of 1400 meters above sea level. Very cool plant. It's cool growing. I grow it intermediate to warm, so um, I think it's doing well because of the humidity. Crank that humidity up. That uh, that makes it a little bit easier. But uh, this plant has put on about one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven new growth. I might be missing one, possibly eight. Anyways, really cool, really excited about this. The, uh, the bloom on this plant actually uh, is like very pendulous. Has about, uh, I think it's like a two inch, has about a two inch spike, and then that has about uh, five to seven inch um, blooms, and they're, um, it's a bunch of blooms really close together, densely packed in there. It looks actually like, um, to me, it looks like a bunch of little bird mouths just all, uh, all perched open along a little inflorescence. Uh, it looks awesome. But uh, yeah, you get those on the matured pseudobulbs. And uh, I have pretty close to a mature pseudobulb. But, hmm, but it has a new growth <laughs> coming off the side. I don't think that's a bloom. It just looks like another, another pseudobulb is forming. But yeah, that will make around eight new growths. So hopefully when they're all mature, they just all bloom at once and I get a crazy show and this turns into quite the specimen plant, but we'll see. Anyways, I had to just hose this guy down or just showered this guy with insecticidal soap. This is Safer's. find this in Canada. Um, I'm from Ontario. We have a pesticide ban down here, so we don't get any of the nasty pesticides you guys might have in the States. You can't spray, like, pyrate, something that's going to kill everything. But this is fine. This does the trick. This is just different types of soaps. Um, I forget what you actually call it. It's, um, it's, um, potassium salts and fatty acids. Potassium salts of fatty acids. How this works is the uh, potassium salts uh, dissolve and they dissolve and weaken the, the outer uh... Lily get out of there out of there get out of there they uh they weaken uh, the uh, exoskeleton of the um, insect and dried out and uh, check your plants after you apply this. Sometimes damage doesn't show for two days, but damage shouldn't even show. If it does, just maybe dilute it a little bit, or, or, um, or just find a different method. But you should have no problem. Safer's is pretty weak, to be honest, but it works really good. But uh, yeah, guys, that's it for today. Hope everyone has an awesome weekend. Take care. Here are all the new growths I was talking about. Here's one. Here's one. There's one. There's another one back there. Um, there's another one right here. But yeah, and then this new growth.
over here. But yeah, there's a ton of new growth. This camera sucks. I'm sorry, guys. Again, not even a camera. It's a friggin' iPad. Thanks, guys. Oh, yeah, that looks deep, doesn't it? But I didn't have anything shallower. Luckily, these roots were already like three and a half inches long. Honest to God, longest bulbophyllum roots I've ever seen. But, uh, yeah, I have styrofoam uh, peanuts down there. I use those religiously. I know it's probably not the best thing to do, but I've just been doing that since the get-go. All right, but take care, guys. Peace.